Finally. You don't look like Violet anymore. Not a trace of her. Any. See? I told you that. I'd changed back. Besides, I hate wearing makeup anyways. Keeping the act for so long certainly damaged my skin. I just hope that I can recover. Now, tell me what's really going on. Trust me. I promise I'd go easy on you with your psychological profile. Anyway, never mind. I'll have to go to the toilet. Damn it. Even in the land of the living, you continue to exist. Stop disturbing me, or you will regret it. Oh. Shit. What. The. Fuck. Are. You. I'm your worst nightmare. Guardian spirit. Don't get in my way. I'm warning you. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. You're dead. But curse your spirit. Likewise. Don't get in my way. Me? Dead? Impossible. Wait. Oh shit I must be in hell. You're a fucking demon. Oh shit. Violet? Silly boy. You're obviously alive. But you're dead also. I don't understand. Fine. Let me tell you. About your gruesome demise. Maybe I should shed some light. Or the dark truth. Before the events that transpired. Let us go back in time. Back to where they were alive. Hello. Isaiah Peters. Okay who the fuck are you? And how do you know my name? Relax man. Just here looking for my wife. I assume she's here? Wears a lab coat. Has a gold necklace? Wait. Hold on a minute. You meant to say. That. Holy shit. Surprised to see yourself? I remembered using that line on another one of us. Of course. Me from the other world. And frankly. That's also my line. I heard you went here. Oh. Uh -huh. I met a girl went here. Did she meet herself? Yeah man. Our girl was shocked to see herself. How come she ain't looking? Older? She looks exactly like her today. Man this is awkward. Well. What do you expect from a scientist? Sure I worked with the. Men in blue. So makes sense that we get to enhance our youth. You sure that? You're not just a clone? I'm on guard here. My apologies for being on high alert. Threat levels just increased. According to Molly. What the hell? You felt it too? Looks like our times are limited. There's a sure disturbance in the space-time continuum. Something in the past or future must have caused this. I have a confession to make. I'm actually... ceasing to exist. Slowly. I'm sorry. Tell Molly that. I loved her. No! 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 Okay. Back to the present. I sense a disturbance. A spirit just entered our room. A ghost? A demon? Or a spirit? It feels... familiar. Yet. I question. How is it that? Tell me bro. You've talked to a demon. Did you? You know how dangerous that is. Yet. The presence here. It's no demon. It's... It's... You? I don't understand. Bro. What are you talking about? I'm sitting right here. With you. 
It's just, well, complicated to explain. But let us go to Detective Orvin's office tomorrow. I heard the sad news of Jane's sudden death.